Okay, so this is uh, number 14, 14. So let's see, I got 180 minus 2y. Um, okay, 180 minus 2y. Well, it's the first thing that strikes me is that 180 degrees is, uh, well, that's a straight line. So I need a straight line. So using your straight edge, you make a straight line. Okay, so that's 180 degrees. From that, I need to subtract... 2y. So I'm going to freehand this for a second. So if I were to say that this right here, um, that right there is equal to 2y, then this angle right here, so we'll call that x, that angle x would be equal to, maybe I shouldn't use x because they're using that in previous problems, but uh, so that angle x in degrees would be equal to 180. So this part right here would be equal to 180. Uh, minus 2i. Okay. Hopefully that made sense. Now, how do you do the actual construction? Okay. So the straight line is not the issue. So step number one, take a straight edge. Let me do this in red. Uh, step number one, take a straight edge and make a straight line. Great. Now we got to, now we, from that, we need to draw 2i. Now 2i, well, I'm, I'm going back to the original one. 2i would be uh, well, as the name implies, it would be two Y. So a Y there and a Y there. So what I really need to do is onto my, uh, on my line right here is I, oops, sorry, I meant to do a freehand there, not a, I meant to do this. So on my line right here, what I need to do is I need to construct two Y angles. So I'm going to go up to my angle right here and I'm going to create that angle onto this line right there. All right, how do you do that? Well, we do the construction of copying an angle or making a congruent angle. Step number one, we draw a segment. Well, I already got a segment drawn right here. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna put a little dot right here. You can put the dot anywhere. I'm gonna go to my, um, I'm gonna go to my uh, original Y value right here, open up my compass. I don't have the document camera here, so I'm just going to freehand this real quick. Um, and I'm going to open up my compass to any distance so that I can draw an arc through the given angle Y. I'm going to go over to my new segment to the point there I just drew and draw that same arc onto, uh, without changing the distance, onto my uh, new segment. I'm just doing the construction of making a congruent segment. All right, I go back to my original, make these tick marks here in blue, go back to my original angle. I mean, I'm going to measure the distance from here to there. So from here to there, I'm measuring that distance with my compass. I'm going to go to my new measurement or my new construction here. And from here, I'm going to place my pointy part of my compass and I'm going to make the arc wherever it appears right there. Then what I can do is I can take my compass or take my straight edge and I can connect from here through that construction. And notice I'm freehanding. It looks nothing like Y, but you get the basic idea. So there's one Y. And then I simply need to do the same thing. But this time, uh, I'm going to draw this in green here. I'm going to use this as my starting point. And I'm going to do that same construction. So what was that construction? Let's see, that construction was, I go to my original angle and I draw an arc. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to erase um, this, even though I don't have to. Uh, and I'm going to make an arc uh, of any distance you'd like. So I make that arc right there. And remember that's from this point right here, any distance out to that arc. I'm going to go to this point right here. And I'm, now I'm not going to make this arc again. I'm going to use the green portion as my new uh, uh, starting position of an angle. And I'm going to make the arc from the dot to there. Okay. Go back to uh, the original angle. Once again, I'm going to measure the distance from here to here and transfer that onto the new arc. But it's going to be from here to here, make my arc. Lastly, I'll draw a play connect the dots uh, and I will connect from the point through this arc intersection and that will be my second Y. So if that's my second Y, then let's see what I made. Uh, y plus Y is two Y. So from here all the way over to here, right? That is equal to two Y. 
So we were asked to do 180 minus 2y. So the actual final, 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 final answer uh, is this angle right here in blue, that angle right there, I'll draw a little arrow right here, that angle is equal to 180 minus 2y. Hopefully that made sense. So there is your answer.